Hi guys, JJ here, back with another episode on the MEP server, and today guys, we are going to be doing some enchanting, because we got quite a big order from Chris, and I hear a zombie upstairs, what does this guy want, where is he, let's see him, we can see him like this, um, hmm, this is actually pretty cool, I, lo I like this, oh, there's a uh, zombie up, no, I won't be able to get him, Nope, scary despawned. Well, that's pointless. Uh, yeah, so someone bought a Unbreaking 3 book, and there was another one here which I just took out of uh, out of stock. Um, five diamonds, someone paid for that. I think, believe this was, it was, yeah, it was Feather Falling for Unbreaking 3. Um, yeah, so someone obviously bought that, and anything changed here? Nope. No one bought anything else. Uh, out of these two, and then we have this order, which is three times protection four, three times unbreaking three. So I've got one unbreaking three already. So uh, we're already part way there, and just shove those diamonds in there, and then we can get going. So I want to head over to the ender ender, and then later on, um, let's just do a quick tour of spawn. So this is spawn. I was about to say server, but that would be that'll take slightly too long. I um, need to repair my pick as you can see and my shovel is coming out for repair sometime soon as well um, yeah so it looks like Chris has put some new paths in which is pretty cool onto this shop which is uh, Caleb's and by the way guys something which um, oh, no you don't nice one hit kill um, yeah this glass I don't uh, do you guys like it or not Personally, I hate the the uh, bits that go through the glass. It's just, it's horrible, just horrible. So I decided to get a um, a glass, a clear glass texture pack, which is um, let me show you. It's this one here, cleaner glass. Yeah, it's got it's got the uh, the wind. What's it called? Wind zip or wind Windex? That's it. Wind zip. Don't know where I got that from. Um. So yeah guys, that's uh, what I'm running at the moment and I actually really like it, it looks so cool. And hopefully once we got this enchanting done, Chris can open up Hunger Games and that's one of the reasons that I'm going to try and do a lot of enchanting um, in the next upcoming few days. Next upcoming few days, that really did, that was not good English, that was not correct English. Um, in the next few days I want to do a lot of enchanting and try and get some of that stuff is the sun coming up we're gonna see a beautiful sun sunrise on the MEP server as the world loads in and it actually ends up blocking the sun is he gonna block the sun? no, oh yeah <laughs> oh I took a screenshot actually that could be the uh, yeah we'll take that as I wondered what it was like we might take that as a um, as a thumbnail you guys will of course already seen this, but uh, apart from that, nothing new really. I th wait, is the flower shop up and running? Let's take a quick look. I don't think it is, but of course, could well be wrong. Um, yeah, so what I wanted to do today, ender ender, and then also the chest room that um, all the sorting that we had coming soon. Okay, it's still not up, but I really like the acacia wood. I love the grey colour of it, but if you guys look, well, I could, could I show you here, no, or I can probably, he's probably got some in here, random blocks, no, random blocks, no, no, oh, that's a shame, um, but the, the orange, I just, I don't like the orange bit, it's just not nice, but anyway, uh, yeah, so I want to decorate the, um, the sorting area, that where it sorts, I'm going to, keep it like like it is now probably just fill it in so no mobs can spawn or maybe light it up I don't know and then underneath that I'm gonna get a uh, like a hopper system that like wait let me just quickly show you guys actually in survival and I've just realized I didn't start my timer brilliant going um yeah so basically um test world what, what are we at yep okay I remember the, um so I was also looking at the new enchanting in here and it was pretty 
damn useless at the moment. I don't like it how you can't change after a while. I'm sorry if this speed is annoying you guys. But yeah, what was I showing you? Um, I can also quickly show you this orange, which I don't like. Just, just don't like that. I love the grey look of it, but as soon as I look at the orange, it's like, no. Just no. Um, oh my god. Oh yeah, that was it. That was it. Um, we got chest and hopper. Okay, that's fine. So, if we build up a few blocks and then put a chest up there. So, at the moment, what we've got is the sorting system going into the back. Oh god. Uh, like so. And then we've got it going into this chest. And then what I want to do is take out of here... Um, okay, let's place a block like so. I want to take the chests like so. And then like, well, of course not this high, but this is kind of the, this is the, this is the idea I've got. Um, like so. And then do that. So basically, if things get in here, if we could just chuck a load of stone in there, and it's going to be going into this chest here, but also it's going to be going right down into here first, and then slowly, once this is full, it'll start filling up these ones, and so basically I want to make it... Um, I don't know exactly how high yet, but I'm thinking probably the room will be three and a half high, or maybe four with like a slab down the... Um, like... So, so, um, like this, and then, oh god, can't, can't place a block, um, yeah, like that. So, maybe the floor at this height so that mobs can't spawn and stuff, I so thought I can just do, like, a bit of glowstone, because, of course, now that we're getting glowstone, we can, uh, put that in the ceiling. So, I'll just have something like this, probably. No, okay, something like so, and then I'll have like all the, um, what do you call them, the, oh, the item frames with the items in them on all of the chests, that kind of thing, or maybe just like um, above it or on one, or on like the, the top row or something, which probably won't get filled up as much as the bottom ones, so that I can still uh, access the bottom ones as easily. So, that's just, just, bleh. oh, shovel's on, oh, nice. Let's say hello to Shuffle. He doesn't check chat very often at all, so uh, it wouldn't surprise me if he uh, did not see that message at all. Uh, rubber banding. No rubber banding. Nope. Don't like rubber banding. So, um, but banding? That's awesome. Um, I never get that. Uh, yeah, so I have actually been... Actually, let's put this book in here just for safekeeping. Don't want to lose that actually, and let's take this out. Um, oh god, no, I don't want to collect all this stuff. Go away. Um, yeah, so what have I been doing off camera? I've been AFK and I've got about a stack of all of the separate items, and we're going to try and avoid this gas so it doesn't end up blowing me up. Uh, where are you actually? I have no clue where that glass is. Glassed. Jeez, my, my speech is a big problem. So yeah, guys, the uh, new snapshot is pretty pretty cool in some aspects, and in some aspects it's just a load of crap. The repairing now, it's sort of, I like it. Oh, this look, this is smooth. That's smooth. Um, it is, it, I like the, um, the repairing, like, cheap, but it, it's time to be, like, too overpowered kind of thing, so that's when I'm like not liking it. It's like seven levels to repair like something that's like absolutely epic. It's like just why why would you do? I sh I think that they should make everything repairable, but then it has to be a very high expensive uh, enchant. And also, uh, Totushek, if you're watching, I don't think he watches anyone's videos actually, but um, someone broke this, so I did move it over. And for the guys on the server, this is a clock. So basically, if you take the redstone that's there, only break this one, because otherwise you'd have to make a redstone torch and get this going again. 
um, and place it there. If you put an ender pearls in there, goodbye ender pearls. So uh, yeah, it's pretty sweet. But um, I'm now going to make a cut, guys, and get going with some enchanting. Ooh, we got one of the uh, anvil. Pretty sweet. So yeah, I need to get going with this uh, enchanting. Ooh, this this is actually kind of scary. Actually, looking at it like this, that's kind of scary. I must say. Um, okay, let's see. Yep, I'm just gonna go full out enchanting boss, guys. You you wait for it. You wait for it. These are all gonna be enchanted by the time you get back. Actually, probably not all of them, but um, I will try and do quite a few. And hopefully you shouldn't be hearing too much of the background noise that you've been hearing before. I think because I started using this um, this headset and the um, the audio was pretty good in the beginning, and then I upgraded my. That was when I after that I got my CPU, and I th I don't know why, but it might be make the motherboard and stuff. It's got the fan settings on like higher um, rotations per minute and stuff, so. I think that might be why, which is kind of annoying. Uh, there's the first one. It's really annoying to see where exactly I've got to be now, actually. But uh, I will get used to it. Uh, respiration three. That's the first one. Okay, guys. So I'm gonna make cut now. Get a load of enchanting down, and I will see you guys in a second. Okay, guys. So we're back, and yeah, as I said, I was doing some work with the enchanting for Chris for the death games. And now we are putting some stuff on the um, the armor. Okay, so I put protection four on the chest plate, and now it has unbreaking on it. So now we have a full Death Games armor chest plate. Hooray! Oh, awesome. Okay, uh, let's see. Next one. Do do. I can get unbreaking on that one. And here, combine these two for me. Oh God. Me? Yeah. How many levels do you need? Uh, I don't know, just combine those, see how many, because I didn't check. Oh, okay. Uh, Hopefully it doesn't hit the level cap. Nope, 21. Okay, sweet. And then the last one that we need to do is the uh, leggings, which I think is... I'm crossing my fingers that it's not going to be the overkill one, but it's going <laughs> to be expensive and it's going to be close. Yeah. I'm nervous. But it's got uh, the Death Games armor, which is named, which is going to cost a few extra levels. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> Oh, it's does, have isn't it? Sharpness three, protection four, looting three, feather falling, uh, sharpness four, and unbreaking three. Of course, the some of them will just get cancelled out. Yeah, but of course. It's always nerve wracking. It's gonna cost a lot, still. I think. I don't think they actually like when they disqualify, um, like enchantments that you know, you, like you can't put sharpness on armor or whatever. I don't think that they actually discount the, like. Experience? Yeah. Give me a pay for it. I think I don't know. Okay, I got 22 levels. You want to give me that stuff, and then I'll check how much it yeah. costs. Let's, oh God. Yeah, I just go down. I'll, I'll just carry on going. I don't trust these stairs at all. <laughs> I no, I, I put them there because I was I was struggling seeing where it was exactly, and now I don't know. It's kind of annoying with the glass because I can never see where I've actually got to go down. Right. And then I, I get confused, and then I, and then I look, walk one. Yeah, I know. I always actually do it on the back fence. Oh, I, I dropped the books down there, by the way. <laughs> oh, okay, I'll go there. Yeah, got twenty-eight levels. Should be pretty much good. Um, Hopefully, twenty-nine levels. Thirty-four 30. that way. Twenty-four, nice. Okay. And now it's oh jeez, fifth. Ooh, yes, only fifteen. We did you it. Got, you got fifteen or? Ooh, yeah, I, I got it. Careful. Dishes. <laughs> okay. Uh, fifteen. Whoa! There we go. We're done. Yeah, we're done. We did it. Awesome. Oh, Death brilliant. Games is now Death Games is it. officially open. Brilliant. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, been waiting for this moment for quite a while. I, know, I am I going to that. carry on. Yeah, just going away at these endermen. Okay. And uh, I can finally kill you. Wow. <laughs> 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 okay, yeah. I think I'll come and join you over there. Okay, guys, I am back, and um, yeah, we've been going for about 20 minutes now, and got these, uh, Respiration 3, Power 3, Fire Aspect 2, which is pretty sweet, Silk Touch 1, also nice, got six of them now, and one with Unbreaking 3, so I'm thinking I might give that to, um, 
to Chris. I don't know. It just seems like having six soul touch and no one buying them, kind of pointless. Um, this is a pretty nice one as well with uh, sharpness three, looting three, affinity four, and then another affinity four and another affinity four. Not back to power four, sharpness three, protection three. Also can give that to um, to Chris if I get another protection three, and um, uh, bane of arthropods four and restoration three. And I think I'm gonna do the rest now, and I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, guys, we are done. We have the full armor in, so I'm gonna quickly take my armor off, jump in here, click. Oh yeah, how do I look? Uh, you look very terrifying. In fact, the helmet doesn't even look red. It just kind of looks like purplish or pink. Yeah, I... because of the <laughs> yeah, yeah which looks kind of silly, but. Yeah, so it's done. Hooray. And then the sword I, and the bow. Forever. So, we got Unbreaking 3, Power 4, Sharpness 4, Unbreaking 3, Full Prop 4, Unbreaking 3, apart from, actually, the boots are only Feather Falling. And then we got Respiration 3 on the, yeah, you're shifting, I see you. Ah. First yep. usage on this bow, yeah. <laughs> ah, you jerk. <laughs> Actually, it didn't even. You, oh, it's unbreaking three, of course. Yeah. And then okay. what else we got? We got arrows and poison two potions, and that's okay. it. And by the way, for the guys all on the server that are watching, um, to put the stuff in, you just put the helmet, helmet, chest plate, uh, leggings, and boots. It's also just noted up here. So pay attention to that instead of uh, chucking them in any random place, because you, it, it'll be difficult to refill. Yes. And also, if any of these things are getting worn down, or uh, need resupply, like so, uh, then let me know ASAP. Yeah. Thank you. And I am now going to put my sword in. Is yours in? Yours is already in, isn't it? Yeah, mine is already in. So, everybody on the server can start entering in their names, and, uh, yeah, start killing people. Woo. Yes. <laughs> you Death to the people on the server. Wah. You can only kill each other if you have been entered into the death games and also their name is in here, of course. And guys, if you feel like it, just read through the um, 10 page uh, rule book. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't quite understand if it counts or not for um, if you died. And whatnot. So that's it. It's yeah, done, that's it. finally. God. Yeah. So, guys, I will uh, see you in a second. Okay, guys, I am back. And yeah, that was a good little bit recording with Chris. We now entered into the death games, guys. This is going to be a lot of fun. So um, yeah, I have been doing something, and let's do this. Hopefully, it works. Brilliant! Just what I wanted. This should be fine. Okay, there we go. So any books? No power, tools, bow. Oh, good sword. Yeah, I want sharpness. Sharpness three, brilliant. That's going to be so much more helpful. Okay, that's that done. So um, yeah, today I said I was going to be making the place over the um the the collecting system. Um, I said I was going to be making it look good. So we are going to jump over there now, guys, and I will see you in a second. Okay guys, I'm back and just quickly show you last night I did this. So it's sort of similar to Dockham's perimeter where you take away the first sign at the beginning and it will start to flood. So once I've taken away all of this dirt, then I will yeah, break that and hopefully it should flood the whole area. So let's jump in our boat and head over. Um I'm gonna be using stained clay and glass because I just I don't know I just love the combination of the two cyan uh, cyan ones and then probably for the floor stone slabs and then item frames for on the chests but of course I don't have any hoppers at the moment because I haven't got any iron so um, we're not going to be able to uh, to sort out the um, the collection system like fully uh, so this is how I've been getting down uh, some witches will hopefully spawn whilst we're down there. Hope you guys can still see something. But this is the way I've been getting down. I just got a spiral staircase and then that goes up there. Oh 
Okay, I also want to make a portal down here. Um, so yeah, this is the collection area. And then we have this down here, and I'll show you what I got so far. Um, that's... Sorry, that might have been a bit too quick. 53 gunpowder, and then 28 redstone. Oh no, can't move. Oh yeah. 46 glowstone, 29 spider eyes, and 20 glass bottles. And then here, we've just got some potions in general. So, let's see. We need to... Well, first we need to, of course, get rid of this, because it's slightly in the way. And then... Okay. Wait, no, why am I getting rid of this? I don't want to get rid of that. That was the uh, wrong thing to do. Nope, and now I'm clicking in the wrong places. Okay, so let's just close that up. We don't want to be able to access this at all. Um, and we sort of need more... Yeah, we sort of need more stone. So, um, there's that gone. And now we can... I believe we can fill in this bit here like so and then so what we're going to be wait let's move over a block what we're wanting to be seeing is okay so we're going to want to be able to see that row there and then the other row on top so let's think um, we're going to have to do slabs some kind of yeah so that's where we're, these come in handy Okay, so those can go like so, and then if we get rid of this, so this, yeah, um, you can still see the redstone behind there. Okay, um, wait, let's, let's, let's think this through logically. How far can I reach? Not that far. So we might, um, Okay, let's just get rid of that quickly. Don't want that up there for the moment. So if we do that, then we do that. That might be better. Yeah, that blocks it off a lot better. Okay, so let's do that quickly. Like so. Why am I shifting now? I don't know. Okay, there. So you can't really see the redstone anymore. So now we can start to block off some other things like this, for example. And also this, um, we are going to want to have a, mm, or are we, yeah we are I think, we're going to want to have another, yeah, so another hopper that comes down here, then a chest there, and a hopper there, pointing this way, and then a chest probably, a double chest probably here, that will also collect items, so behind here, what I wanted to do, oh wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. No, wait, I've, I've thought this through wrong. I've, I've done this wrong. Okay, I wanted to do it differently. I remember why now. Okay, so let's click, collect those slabs again. And I can't collect all of them, which is kind of annoying. Ah. This is one annoying thing about not having much space to work with, even though we do have quite a lot of space. Okay, let's just collect them. Okay, there we go. Block that off. So what I wanted to do was, let's see, let's think this through again. Um, actually guys, I think I'm going to quickly, yeah, I'm going to go off camera, make a cut, and I'm going to try and think up some stuff, and I'll be back in one second. Okay guys, I am back, and yeah, I've got this going here. Still need some more slabs, and we'll of course have to put the other hoppers and chests in later on. I'm probably going to put a hopper here, then a hopper here, and then a chest there and there. So it's got a double chest at the bottom, single at the top. Should be enough storage, and of course we've got this as backup kind of thing. And uh, it's still been running whilst we've been going. How many? Yeah, see. Pretty sweet that it just sort of goes whilst you're working here. So we're going to light this. Actually, we've already got that in our inventory. Go through and then set the portal in the nether, which should be behind the other portal. Um, yeah, so which coordinates do we need? We need, um, let's see, um, 
apparently we need. Okay, wait, where's the center? That. According to this, what's it say? 19818. Okay, let's just go up to there. Oh no, 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 no. Um, damn. I hate lava in the nether. It it just flows so quickly. It's ridiculous. It is is a death. It's just death, instant death. Gone. Yeah, good. Um, eighteen, twenty. 18, yeah, okay, brilliant. And now we can shove some torches in here. I'm not going to do this path now because I kind of find it kind of pointless. We also need to go to 18 on the left side. Yeah. That should be 100. Wait, 198. I didn't mean 18. Jeez, that would be a bit too far. Um, okay, so this is where the portal is going. Get rid of some area. Some area, some netherrack, <laughs> some area. I'm not quite entirely sure what area it is, but it'll do. I was planning on doing three by three um, things, but then it didn't work. Uh, it didn't work in the overworld, so I had to change it to this. And it should, yeah, it takes us down to here. Awesome. And then this, if we go in here, should take us hopefully to the correct one in the nether. Yes, brilliant. Okay, lovely. I need to go get some more clay because that's my last cyan stained clay, which is kind of bad. I need to pay Kyle back anyway for some clay that I sort of took from his savannah place because uh, one time I I did I thought it was just a, it was a um the place in the top of the nether was just a quick way to his um I thought it was just a quick way to hit the the um oh god what the um the mesa the mesa biome I thought it was just a quick way to the mesa biome but it turned out to be his savanna place and so I quickly took three stacks of clay because that was what I needed and so I sort of need to pay that back so um, yeah guys that's gonna be it for this episode I'm probably gonna finish this off off camera and uh, I'll see you in the next episode guys so thank you for watching I'll see you next time bye.